Welcome again and thanks for joining us for Links Le Bleu 7 TV. Let's talk. Well, the family of the former ex-lover of the female in question that made rounds on social media of popular comedian Major Hype is actually speaking out. And one of her sister took to Instagram Live just to share with the general public what Major Hype ex-wife or ex-lover, I should say, have been through. She shared some really chilling details and also went emotional at one point in the video. And we have that now to share with you right now on Links 7 TV. Let's talk. We'll be right back after this break. Welcome back and thanks for joining us for the program. This is Links 7 TV. Let's talk. Well, the situation between Major Hype and his ex-lover is one of the most talked about and most viral story of the week. What transpired between the two is very sad and it's one of those situations that is very unfortunate also that spilled over on social media just this week. All I can say is that Major Hype and Kirby just need to take this time out for themselves just to reflect on where their relationship went wrong and just where they want to be as it relates to their own psychological well-being and their emotional well-being during this time. What happened in this relationship is what many people are going through throughout the world and this is not an isolated issue because many people are faced with similar circumstances and challenges as it relates to being in a relationship. However, we're going to let the family member of Major Hype um, ex-lover share their side of the story and what they believe the female went through. Let's go over to that right now on Links to Blow 7 TV. Hi. Hey, love. What is your name? Crystal. Hi, Crystal. Hey. All right. Welcome. Thank you for Thank accepting. You. All right. Um, I don't, I don't want to stay on here too long because I get it. You know, it's a lot going on. So I'm just going to give you the floor. Is there anything you want to clear up to, to support your sister and clear her name? Um, one, she didn't release that video. Two, he has been hitting on her. She did disattach herself from the family for a long time. Um, it's been hard for us. Um, even today was hard. And um, Can I ask you a question? Sure. How, how is she right now? Because today was horrible. Um... It's stressful. It's embarrassing. I mean, she's, you know, feeling the, I mean, everyone's really supportive right now and I'm happy for that. Well, not everyone, of course, but sorry, I'm a little nervous. I don't really okay, but I get it. How are um, you feeling as her big sister? Terrible. You know, I'm seven years older than Kirby. Um, it's hard for me to see people who don't know her, like, judge her and um, believe things that he's saying or, you know, he's just violating her privacy. And it's and, and a lot of the things is all twisted up. It's just a lot going on. And I'm not doing too good about the situation. But, you know, I have to be strong for her and my family. Are you physically around her that you can go and give her a hug? Um, yeah, she's with me. Can you just give her a hug and tell her there's so many people who I don't are want praying to for her? <laughs> she's listening. We we are praying for her. Like I literally prayed for her today, and and from the first time she did that video, just let her know there's some everybody here on this live. There's so many people um, who are praying for her and sending her good energy and making sure we pray a hedge of protection around her, not just from him. 
but just the elements, you know, I know this can be really hard. It's traumatizing. People don't understand, like, this is, like, real life. Kirby's not a gold digger. Kirby's educated. She went to school, of course. You guys know she was a cop. He met her. She had everything. We had a good childhood. He's trying to make it seem like we did it. We did. We are. We were okay. I'm not saying that, you know, the text messages between them wasn't, like, it wasn't, like, all positive, but he that's how he is. I've experienced certain things with him. So I know how he is. He can, he's weird. he's weird. I have a question for you. You said you've experienced certain things with him, probably because of the close proximity. Hi, Kirby. Thank you for coming on. Let me ask you this very direct question. And you, you would be, you'd be able to know that he's like that because you're her sister. Do you think other artists, and people around in the industry know he's like that um what abusive yeah physically um no i think it was a big secret it's, it was okay. definitely a big secret you know she so I, mean, it. I know for sure that it, it happened because you know when she came back home we she went to the hospital she couldn't even walk he doesn't really want me to talk so i you know I, I've, I've been trying to be really respectful to everyone but after his life today it's so disgusting because i've seen my sister in physical pain and actually after the first time that when she came home and she had to go to the hospital like after that he's me and him disconnected we used to be cool, but once he did that to my sister, you know, I had to go in big sister mode. And then I had to play the part to be cool. So because she was disattaching, so I had to like go around and act like, you know, things was okay. And I, I forgot, but I, you know, I, it's hard. It's been hard. How can we, I know Kirby's on the live, but I'm asking you, how can we best support Kirby right now? I mean, less bashing, you guys. Well, not you, of course. Huh? Like, let us heal, help her heal. Okay. It's okay, baby. <sighs> um, I'm so appreciative that you would be so brave as a big sister and I, I I'm a big sister too and not to share my own personal business but you know I found out that my younger sister was being beaten by her husband and she's given me a you know authority to talk about that because she's not ashamed of it anymore but that hurt that I wasn't there for her I am so happy that you are there for your sister I am so happy that you are there for her. And let me tell you something. You see this, 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 this light work that some of us on this live is doing. See when our prayers go up, God hears our prayers. Okay. Like we know Psalm 23 by heart. Okay. Like God hears our prayers and it is okay to cry. It's, it is to a total normal reaction to feeling violated. He, he Your spoke whole about family my mom. He spoke about my mom, my grandmother, my 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 just my family and we 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 respected and we didn't even say anything about him. We didn't say anything because Kirby's a woman and she with this whole his, his situation like we've been going through it. We know I knew he what he was doing over there. I knew her. I know my sister. I knew she was hurt. He couldn't like she couldn't even look me in the eye. It it was such a disconnect, and people don't know. So before they bash her, you know what I'm saying? Like it's just a lot. So you know, respect her healing process. I ask everyone to. You know, he's going to do whatever it takes, but he forgets that there's something called the law. And there's also 
it, it, he's forgetting a lot of facts. The simple fact that my entire family is law enforcement. My mother's a retired NYPD officer. I'm going there too. My father's mm. a retired lieutenant colonel for the army. Mm. Mm. And a retired police officer. Mm. My brother's like, I, like he's, mm. real, he's not, he doesn't really have that much of a strong team mm. or the support system to really, really break down who we are. We're well connected. So don't ever, Nigel, think you could come from my family like that? My sister left her career. It's a lot, sis. But he, you know what? Kirby has a purpose. She's going to use her voice and her power and her connections to speak up for domestic violence. <laughs> Today was really, it was really, really hard. <laughs> well, there you have it. That was the sister of the lover of major hype kirby giving her, her side of the story and also went emotional at one point of the video in which she breaks down totally after sharing her information or what she knew about the whole entire situation between the relationship and how everything went down all i can say is that what happened here is very sad and it's more like, it's more of an unfortunate situation that it had to spill over onto social media in which everyone now is basically talking about the whole situation, even the video as well, how it um, came such a, as a talk around town, it still remains a mystery because right now, no one is basically aware of how the video leaked. And even though many are speculating that the video itself shared real chilling details as it relates to what was going on, it's still not a good look because one have to remember that the female in question, she has a child. And at some point in time, that child will become an adult and that video will be out there for an extended period of time, maybe forever. And he might come across that video. As I can say, as you could see the sister here, the sister shared her side of the story and is actually speaking out on the behalf of her sister. She's actually there just trying to provide that support to the sister during this difficult time. Whether or not what happened between the two um, is actually true because both of them are basically stating that they went through different form of abuse. I'm not here to be the judge of that. I'm not here to speculate or even to take sides. I'm just here to just give you my own personal opinion and my own views as it relates to what happened. All I can say is that what happened is very sad. And it's a situation which many females face. And it's a situation that many males face as well. Have to be enduring with abuse and all sorts of things especially when they're so much in love with the female. Sometimes love captivates their whole being and they, even when the relationship is not going right, they tend to look otherwise. But all I can say, I just hope that the two does try to just recover from this and try their very best to move on from it as well. This has been Links 7 TV, let's talk. And I'm going to leave this one here for now. Drop it in the comment section. Let me know how you feel about this one. Peace out, bless.